Hey everybody, the Bonga's back. Welcome to part 19 of Let's Play Dynasty Warriors 5, brought to you by GameAnyone.com. Alright, it's time to head back to Jurong's campaign, which should be the final stage. After defeating Wu, we did have a moment's peace, but now Shu has come from the north, leading a large army to attack us. I'm sure that this battle will prove difficult to handle, but we have the greatest king of all time, my husband, on our side. The great king of Nanjong, Meng Huo. Now that's a husband a girl can be proud of. Together, we'll protect this land from all those that would try and take it. This battle is different from the others. This shoe is dangerous. They just might see through our weak points and try and set traps to defeat us. I'll deal with the enemies that come straight at us. Here, you back me up and confuse the enemy. Be sure and go and help any of our allies that need it. King Meng Huo refuses to forgive those that try and take our land. All of you that call this land home, I shall protect you. Alright, so this is the final stage of the Nanmon campaign, and said to be pretty tough for obvious reasons. Alright, so I think this magma wheel would be better because it fills my Muso gauge faster. Alright, so we'll go over the conditions. We just had to defeat Zhuge Liang over there to the northeast. Make sure, of course, Mang Wu does not get killed. Alright, so he's got quite a few sub officers with him Masu, Zhang Yi, and Wang Ping. They're over there to the west. Yue Ying should be over there, and I believe she'll have some juggernauts with her. So, if you want to get the Muso armor, you have to defeat one juggernaut unit, and then the rest of them within five minutes of killing the first one. Right, Wei Yan's over there, Guan Xing and Guan Suo. Alright. So, we'll start attacking from the south and then work our way up. Chew them up and spit them out! We'll go stir up some trouble from behind. Alright, as you can see, there are some paths that are, like, slowly faded. Those are hidden passages. Because you're of the Nanmon forces, you get to see them right away. Whereas if you were Shu, you would have to actually look for them. God, all oh, these are alive. Oh, yeah. Juggled, I don't like that. Left unfulfilled. Oh great, now Wei Yan decided to show up. I guess we attracted his attention. It's over already. He'll be a tough cookie to fight. I believe he has the dim sum. So if you want to get like 20 extra HP, you better defeat him. Or let somebody else defeat him, just as long as you're near him. Death has come. Good, a Muso Rage. I definitely needed that. That'll make the rest of the fight pretty easy. Now that I got that bit of insurance. Okay, we're losing a little bit of morale. That's not good. But I think that base over there is, of course, theirs. Seeing as how there's a lot of red. If they're so eager to die, then we'll be happy to invite So once we take that, it should be fine. There. Now they won't be attacking us from here. Okay. I think next, we just go a little north to that base over there in the open field. I don't think there's any officers nearby, maybe sub-officers, but we should deal with it quickly. So it looks like they might be heading that way themselves. Yeah, that's definitely not attack base. Beautiful. Yeah. 
Yeah, we're gaining like three attack points just from being here. Oh, that's quite Not impressive. Bad. Oh, there's a cash here. Oh, King Duosi got beaten by Huang Zhong. Alright, there's no uh main officers over there to the left. Probably just sub officers. Those are probably some of Zhuge Liang sub officers hey, I believe. They're running away! Pulling back. No, you fool, it's a trap! What are you doing? You know that's what they want you to do. Let him go. We'll just deal with them to make sure these don't run away. They're trying to lure us. That ought to learn ya. Okay, Wong Ping's down. So we should probably go after Huang Zhong quickly. Are explosives. You defeat them. On? We're supposed to be invincible. There must be someone behind this trick. Find them and rip out their throat. Okay, gotta defeat all the task force members. Because these pots, they start to shake after a while, and then they blow up. So I think if you defeat all the task leaders, you'll take care of that attack altogether. Uh-oh. I can rescue him, alright. Ow! And some of these pots do respawn, I believe. Is that all the task leaders? No. There must be another one. Unfortunately, you can't see them. Wait, where is, like, Dong Tuna and Ahui Nan? Okay, there's one over there. If I don't rescue them, they'll probably defect. First, let me take out those remaining task leaders. You thought your stupid toys could stop us? There, okay. We should be in the clear for now. We shall lead the way! Everybody, attack! I do want to get over to Wang Zhong. Behold the power of my juggernaut. Ah, what the? It's spitting fire! Yep, they're doing a lot of damage. Enemy reinforcements are headed this way. Lock up the bases before they come out! Occupy the checkpoint? Yeah, let me deal with that first before we deal with Yue Yang's forces. That would be a good idea. I'll ignore that base. Anything, we just gotta keep the enemies from, like, uh, outnumbering us vastly. Because if they get over there, they're gonna. Okay, I gotta rescue Jin Wan Sun Jay and Ahui Na next. Do you think you can stop me? Yes. That I practically just did. Oh, you had a weapon. Good. I can use that. They won't be getting any more backup now. Okay, that definitely helped. All right, where's Jin Huan Sanji too? Over there. And Hawei Nan's over there. All right. Okay, we can't lose too many of our own forces. Otherwise, they're gonna start heading for our camp. We are spearheading this attack. We mustn't fail in our mission. Battles are not won on strength alone. What are you doing, dear? Whatever I want. Let's deal with Liao Hua. That ought to learn ya. 
Okay, there's Jung Bao. Okay, G1 Sanjay, you should be alright now. I still don't trust that Juggernaut. Okay, I got comboed, only to be comboed immediately after that? Come on now. Okay, get that health. Beautiful. The enemy is blocking our reinforcements. No. Oh yeah, I might want to get that. Oh, every time you hit get hit by the juggernaut, you get knocked right down. Okay, that's one. Now I have to defeat the remaining ones within like five minutes. That won't be easy, considering some of them are spread out. And also, whenever you get hit even once by them, you're knocked down for a few seconds. So that don't help matters either. I guess an easy way to do this is to get on your horse. And then just hold L1 and just attack him that way. That way you can just flank them a lot faster. Is there any more juggernauts nearby? Oh, there's one. There's two! Two juggernauts! Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. Huh? I don't find this a laughing matter at all. Well, at least when they attack, I mean, they're wide open. Now get off my property before I throw you out. Uh oh. Ungrateful beast, my blade shall tame you. Okay, get up, get up, don't die. Oh. I don't know if that's the last juggernaut either. It ain't. All right. Yeah, there's another one over there. Is that health? Yes. Let me get my Muso ready. Oh, good. That's an elite guard. So you should drop health. This battle can still end quickly. Oh, stop getting comboed when you're at red. I think I see two. Health drop. Did any health drop? No health dropped. That's because the elite guard wasn't even dead. Allow us to lend a hand. Did I get all the juggernauts? I don't even know. So let's just summon up UA Ying. Let's go! Join the attack! There. Forgive me. That ought to learn ya. Now, I just gotta look for the remaining juggernauts. Maybe I have to defeat Yue Ying, too. Hurry! Go and put the herd on it. I don't see any juggernauts. Did we defeat them all? Or did I miss the time deadline by barely a few seconds? Nope, there's another one. Yeah, I think I should still have some time. Okay, all Juggernaut's been destroyed. Good. And there's the item. It shows up right there to the south. And there is some fighting going on, too, so that makes it even better. Oh, Wutugu got beaten. I think Huan Zhang might be at 8 morale. Not, he will be. We have a chance to win this. Oh, we got a slim chance, though. Good, I knocked him off his horse. Oh, I was gonna hit him with the moose, so. Don't let me. No! Deadlock! Okay, good, I won. 
but then I get knocked down. Oh god. Oh, I defeated Hong Jong. Good. To die on the battle is such good fortune. That ought to learn you. All right, let's defeat Yan Yan to get his stat up. I think he was under Huang Zhong. So this is to be my final battle. That ought to learn you. Next is Guan Suo. There we go. Now we probably got him as a sitting duck. Damn. It's over already. Oh, I forgot that defense up over there. I might want to get that before it disappears. Alright, I think the uh, item, like, where did that show up to? Valuable item, valuable item, item, item. Oh! It's just to the south of the base, sorry. Now, attack! So it should be right over here. That should be the Muso armor. Yeah, I think we got things under control now. Hurry! We'll head east. Go and put the herd on them! I still have my Muso Rage ready for Juge Leong. Did we, uh, take care of that base are crumbling. to get our reinforcements back? I don't think so. Alright, Muso Wine should be around here, if I recall. So let's go get that. Nope, that's just health. I guess I needed that too. I'll take that base. Let's go. Okay, so far there's actually been a pretty tough fight. There's been many a close call. However, we're still alive. Hmm. Did I miss the uh, Muso wine? Well, let me grab that cash first. Should be around here on the Poison Marsh. If I recall. Is that it? No. I think I gotta go this way. Let's do that. Oh, Masu got beaten. Okay. At least we know Dong Tuna's still doing alright. That makes me a happy camper. I have some catching up. You think? Oh, there was the Muso one. It was right here. Now let's head for their base. I think we've done enough damage. Oh, it looks like Mongwa himself is behind the enemy lines. I think I better join them. Of our entire main forces over there. Really hate to miss out on all the fun. Oh yeah, that was just the sure checkpoint I took hard not time long ago. Here. There, huh? Belatedly. Get up. Just destroy their juggernaut on one hit. This should be over shortly. Oh, deadlock of that guard captain. I'll just wait till it's over, then I'll kill him. There. Okay, I think that you know there is another stronghold over there. I'll take that before I aggro Juga Leong. as far south as possible so he doesn't come to me. Nice. To see that many soldiers clear out at once, it's so gratifying. 
There's a guard tower, isn't there? Yeah, there's there's archers up here. Oh, I'm too far up front. Ow! Stop it! Wow, you guys suck so bad for being so annoying. Yeah, that archer tower is up there too. There. That should be all of them around here. Is there any more archer towers I need to worry about? I don't think so. So let's just go right into the fray. My intellect will not be outdone by your shallow skill. All right, now it's boss you time. Suffer for that. You say that, but you're the one frozen solid. Fantastic. Now it's my turn to impress you. Except you kind of don't. Let me take that down. It's a bit of an eyesore. Oh, you still got an attack bonus. Can't go having that now. Jeez, every time you hit him with that, he gets frozen. You are skilled, but the advantage is still mine. I don't have time for scrawny little wimps like you. Okay, where'd he go? Oh, jeez, he's over there. Got the jump on me. I don't like that. Oh, I have failed to realize my plans. That ought to learn ya. Victory is ours, sweetheart. You bet it is. Our land is free again. And with all of you by my side, I will be the greatest king of all! And there we go. That's our final campaign that we're going to do. And now the rest of the stages will be done in free mode. Phew! I hope you understand that Nanjiang means business now. If you think you can conquer us, you're sorely mistaken. Everybody, I want to thank you for fighting so hard. Yellow turbans, Wu, Chu, they've all fallen before me. Now there are none left to threaten our land. A golden era for Nanjiang is about to begin. All right, so let's take our spoils. No, no. No, well, technically I was looking for that anyway. Hey, our Peacock game that got upgraded. Nice. Now it's up to level 15. Of course, the highest level you can get is 20. Wow, 19 extra attack power. Sign me up. 12 extra defense power. That's good, too. Okay, well, this is actually much better. Much better. Look at that. Yeah, definitely replacing this. It was up by only speed. Nah, we'll replace this one. Oh yeah, Zhu Rong's got some really good weapons for when she attempts for her th fourth weapon. So, enjoy the ending. It was during the final days of the year 200 AD when the Han Dynasty saw its end. Its demise ushered in a new era of chaos brought on by several regional lords vying to rule China. There were those who sought absolute power, as well as those who fought for justice, and some simply fought for the sake of their beliefs. Many would rise and fall in their attempts to dominate the land. Zhu Rong from the land of Nanjiang. It was believed that she was descended from the goddess of fire. She was known as an aggressive warrior who was an excellent rider and a master of throwing knives. She later became the wife of Meng Huo and aided her husband in his efforts to become the Nanman King. 
the two made a formidable pair, subjugating tribe after tribe throughout the region. Meng Huo successfully became the Nanman king, but the fighting did not end there. Although invasions from the north by forces like the Yellow Turbans and Wu occurred frequently, Zhu Rong was always there to defend Nanzhang. The ties among the Nanman tribes became stronger with every battle against the invaders. This eventually allowed Meng Huo to become the king of Nanman. However, Zhuge Liang, Nanman's greatest enemy, soon led his army toward their land. Meng Huo marched his forces straight into the enemy lines to stop their advance, while Zhu Rong took advantage of the local terrain and harassed the enemy from behind. The mighty strategies of Zhuge Liang could not overcome them or the people's love of their homeland. Although the land was still engulfed in chaos, it was the least of Meng Huo and Zhu Rong's concerns. The descendant of the fire goddess supported her proud Nanman king, and the two protected Nanzhang together. These tales, passed on for generations, have endured the tests of time and live on even today. Alright, so our score was not that bad. I mean, we cracked like over 1300 KOs in like four missions. Just enjoying our life together. I guess war does have its moments. But nothing is better than this. That's a bit of a feel-good ending right there. Alright, so I'm going to stop the video right here, and then the next episode, from now on... Any stages we're going to be doing will be done in free mode. The reason why I'm going that route is because doing too many campaigns would be dull. We'd have many of your stages being done repetitively, and stages that I would not have done repetitively would have been done by um, characters that have already been a campaign as, and it would have been a bit too easy. So why don't we start from 180 AD to the Battle of Xiliang in the next episode. Goodbye everyone, thanks for watching.